Lily is a breed of dog called a beagle. Did you know that a beagle could use its powerful sense of smell to follow another animal's tracks, even if they're buried under deep snow? Welcome, welcome, Lily. What seems to be the problem? You look very itchy, Lily. Shall we take a closer look at your fur and see what's making you so itchy? Let's use this magnifying glass. A magnifying glass helps us to see tiny things very clearly and in more detail. Aha! Just as I expected. You have jumpy, itchy little fleas having a party in your fur. Robbo, can you fetch the flea vacuum, please? Let's suck those little fleas right up. Let's count the fleas. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's it. We got them all. Those pesky fleas are so troublesome. Look. They're carrying on with their party. Lily, you are now flea free. Cats are members of the feline family, which means Sarah here is actually very closely related to lions and tigers. But Sarah's a lot friendlier. Hello, Sarah. Shall we take a look at you? I promise I'll be gentle. Hmm, let's have a look. Sarah, your tummy looks very big. Have you been eating too much? Oh. Hmm, let's have a listen to your heartbeat. Well, listen to that. You have four heartbeats and a large tummy. Does anyone know why Sarah might be feeling unwell? She's pregnant and she's about to give birth. Let's count how many kittens Sarah gives birth to. One, two, Three beautiful kittens. Well done, Sarah. You're a mummy. Gordon the hamster. Hamsters like Gordon are very good at digging. They create big burrows in the soil where they live. Hi Gordon, you look like you're enjoying your wheel there. Oh dear, this is not good. It looks like you're going to be sick. Have some water. Water makes you feel better by getting rid of headaches and keeping you refreshed. How often do you spin in your wheel, Gordon? Hmm, 
I think Gordon is travel sick. If you're going to play on your wheel for that long, you need something that will stop you feeling sick all the time. Ask your mummy or daddy to give you a spoonful of this every morning when you wake up and at night when you go to sleep and you can play all day long. Let's see how many circles Gordon can do in his wheel now, shall we? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten! Fantastic, Gordon. You really are talented. Felix, you're an hour late. Tortoises can live for a very long time. Some can live to 150 years old. I think I know what the problem is, Felix. Are you tired of being late for everything? It must be very difficult walking quickly with that big, heavy shell of yours. Do you have any ideas, Robbo? I do have something in mind. Roller skates. Great idea, Robbo. Let's try on this pair of roller skates. Let's try it out, Felix. Try and zoom around the cones. Ready, steady, go. Done, Felix. I don't think you'll be late again. Many people think that goldfish have trouble remembering things. This is actually not true. Goldfish have memories that last three months. I do hope Lucy remembers what she's come here for today. Hi, Lucy. How can I help you today? Stop, 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 Lucy, before you hurt yourself. Hmm, I think I may know what's wrong, but I need your help, Robbo. I think Lucy needs an eye test. Please can you get some words up on the screen for Lucy? One eyesight test coming right up. Lucy, can you read this? Don't worry, Lucy. K R a B spells crab. Let's try another. Never mind, Lucy. Sh a l spells shell. Hmm. I know. Robbo, I think Lucy has a problem with her eyesight. Can you please fetch the reading goggles? Try these out, Lucy. They're super special goggles that make you see better. Sometimes humans need to wear glasses to help them see better too. A perfect fit. Let's see if that makes a difference. That's right, Lucy. Ish spells Fish! Well done! I think you just needed a pair of glasses, didn't you? Here's Colin the Chameleon. Chameleons are a special type of lizard. And did you know that the tongue of a chameleon can be longer than its entire body? Now then, Colin, what can we do for you? A chameleon has special skin, which means they can change colour to blend in with their background. This is called camouflage. Let's test it out, shall we, Colin? <whistles> hey guys, meet Robbo. Hello everyone. Robbo is my friendly robot helper here in the treatment room. That's right. 
I've got all of the tools that we need to help the animals feel better again. I can even use my tickling stick. <laughs> Robbo, please can you swap the colours of the backgrounds for Colin and we'll see if he can change to the right colour. Red. This is red. But oh dear look, Colin has changed to blue. Yellow. This is yellow. But Colin has changed to red. Green. This is green. But Colin has changed to orange. There's definitely a problem here. Robbo, I think Colin needs to relearn which colours are which. Test you again, Colin. Red. Well done, Colin. We can hardly see you. You're red. Yellow. Excellent work, Colin. You're now yellow. Green. Perfect. You got all three right, Colin. You're now a lovely shade of green. It looks like you're all cured. What a day it's been at the Pet Rescue Centre today. I hope you've had as much fun as we did. See you next time from me, Dr Poppy. And from me, Robbo. Bye. Bye.